Hezbollah has been raising the stakes amid heightened tensions in its ongoing confrontation with the Israeli military along the border, saying to the Israelis that we may not want war, but we are prepared for one. And it's the enemy who should be afraid because nowhere in Israel will be safe. Hezbollah is also saying that if Israel widens the conflict, there will be a ripple effect across the Mediterranean. Hassan Nasrallah threatening to target the Mediterranean Sea, saying it will be in a similar position as shipping in the Red Sea, going as far as to threaten Cyprus, warning Cyprus that don't allow Israel to use your facilities and your territory to launch any attacks against Lebanon or else you will become a legitimate target. Hezbollah really has been in recent weeks showcasing its capabilities. It's part of deterrence, trying to tell the Israelis do not dare launch a wider war because it will be costly. No doubt Hezbollah is a very different organization than it was in 2006, a much more powerful organization. Israel has been a threatening a full-blown conflict if Hezbollah doesn't pull back from the border. The U.S. envoy was in Beirut and Tel Aviv trying to bring about a diplomatic settlement to this conflict, but so far he hasn't been able to achieve much because Hezbollah is linking a possible end to the firing uh, to a permanent end to the war on Gaza. So the situation is serious, a critical moment, but still both sides are still complying, if you like, with the unwritten rules of engagement, which means the conflict is largely confined to the border and to military targets.